Owl TV. Hi everybody. Just thought I'd do another video. And I thought was this is kind of spur the moment thing. Do you like the new Owl TV hat? It's nicer, a bit more cleaner than the old one. You've seen from some of my Facebook posts that I've got a new cap at the moment and um, I'm trying to expand the brand. I'm trying to expand our TV, trying to make it really phenomenal, make it something which motivates, encourages, and inspires all of you. So today, as I said, on a spur of the moment, I thought to do a broadcast and I'd like to talk about time. Now, time is something which is, the cliche is time is very precious, time is memorable, time uh, falls from our fingers. All I can say is we all wake up with the same minutes in the day, the same number of seconds. It's how we use those hours, minutes and seconds is which counts. A lot of people can find that they're actually working and they're sleeping, they're eating. They've got a lot of spare time, a lot of dead time as well. Spare time is, you know, when you come home from work, you're vegging out in front of the television, you're um, just wasting time playing games on your phone, you're, I don't know, just chatting with people. Sometimes it's beneficial, sometimes it's therapeutic. I'm not going to deny that. But at the same time, there are many times when, for example, these um, the time can be used very more constructively. Um, a lot of uh, people, when they're commuting, say going to work, they have a lot of dead time. That time, I suppose, can be used constructively. Listen to podcasts, read a book, um, meditate. Time when you come home from work, if you allocate time effectively, you can achieve a lot. If you're studying for something, you can come home from work, have some food, rest a little bit, you know, get on with your studies, get on with your course and do what you need to. Come home from work, go to the gym, use your time wisely, allocate your time. Remember, time is precious. You need to use it to your advantage. So when you always think you don't have time, try and reevaluate what you could do with that time to your advantage. Plan your day. Find out how many hours you have in a day that you are doing nothing or you are allocating to certain things. Obviously, the main things are sleep, work, other family commitments, um, seeing friends, etc. But if you've got some time where you're not doing anything, can you use that to your advantage? Do you have to watch television? Do you have to go out to the pub or what have you? Do you have to... Um, I don't know, go to bed at a certain time. Can you forfeit half an hour's sleep to concentrate on your life goal? Just this is something which is um like food for thought. Have a little think. And um, again, I'll send you an LTV broadcast very, very soon. So remember, follow me on Facebook on my page, LTV. Follow me on um, YouTube on Phoenix 8 Fitness. And also, um, if you have any friends who are friends with me on Facebook, Obviously, send some friend requests. If you have any friends who want to be motivated, encouraged, inspired by me, come and see my, um, I like my Facebook page. Like my YouTube page as well. And drop me any messages if you know me. I'm here for you. I want to make this something which, when you listen to, you feel entertained for two reasons. Sometimes my posts can be funny. But now I'm trying to be a bit more serious, trying to make you aware of certain things like time is a certain type of commodity, use it to your advantage, look at life in the right kind of way. I mean, the right kind of way is, you know, use it, don't don't feel negative about things, be positive, good things will happen. I hope that all makes sense. I look forward to um, doing another Owl TV broadcast very, very soon. You take care, enjoy the rest of your day. Bye-bye.